spot. Do you accept Brian as your love wife? I do. To the woman who I now will call my wife. I may not be perfect, but I always try to make up perfect. You've always been the one person who has stuck by me through some pretty bad times in my life where not many people would. And for that, I appreciate it. For that, I appreciate it. We'll always do the same for you. I promise I will stop leaving my jocks on the floor, clean the toilet, and stop farting in bed. But most importantly, I promise to always be there for you and our beautiful kids, day in, day out, from the little stuff to the big stuff in life. Even when you have a meltdown and you don't like your hair and makeup, I'll be there for you to cry on from now until the end. I love you. Bria, do you accept Scott as your husband? Almost six years ago, years ago now, we met, just two friends joking about running away to the Greek islands together. But never did I think we would actually be standing here one day vowing ourselves to each other. We've come so far in these past six years and accomplished things together that I'd never even dreamt of myself. Our greatest achievement by far being our two beautiful daughters. I'm so proud of the man and father you've become and I can't wait to take on this new adventure together as husband and wife. From this day on, I promise to trust and value your opinions and stand by most of your actions. I'll always treat you as my best friend and my equal, and I'll always listen to your advice and occasionally take it. I promise to remember not to leave all the cupboard doors open and not to kick you in bedroom and snore, and I promise to be ready on time to leave the house when we need to, even if it's two hours earlier than necessary. I'll always try to make you laugh when you're mad at me and try not to give you too much stuff when I'm grumpy or hungry. And I promise to love you unconditionally and take you as my husband, friend, school mentor and lover. We can now officially pronounce your husband and wife. Congratulations. God, you made this the right.